Episode 2 gave me a lot of what I wanted. I was very pleased with it. My microphone's over here, so we're going to do that again. Uh, <laughs> Full Metal Alchemist Brotherhood, Episode 3. Episode 2 gave me a lot of what I wanted. Much slower pace, uh, a lot more explanation of what's actually going on. We were explained as to how alchemy works. Really cool concept. Really excited to see more animation and more types of alchemy. We've got the complete, almost, backstory of Ed and Al, of what actually happened with the human transmutation fail, and Ed's glimpse into the truth, how he lost his arm and leg, and how Al ended up in the suit of armor. More characters, a uh, little bit of development with Roy and Winry and Hawkeye, as well as Bradley. Bradley just seems on an entirely different level with this sword. And Ed and Al are on their way to Lior, I believe, to visit someone, hopefully, who knows something about how to get Al's body back. Something to do with the Philosopher's Stone, I believe. I'm pretty keen to get right into this one. I'm really enjoying the discussions at the end of the episode, so stick around for that. Hoping to get more of a glimpse into the, the world that's going on here in Full Metal Alchemist and figure out more about what Ed and Al are, are looking for. So here we go. If one wishes to obtain something, something of equal value... Yeah, matter be cannot be created or destroyed. Of equivalent exchange. laws. The basis of all alchemy. It's interesting thinking about that a little bit more than, now that I've seen that a second time. You can't create something out of nothing, so in order for them to have created their mother again, it would have had to have taken some of their, their own matter, right? And I know they dropped some of their blood into the mixture, but it could have been Al's entire body... Ed's arm and leg, so that, that's really interesting to think about. God's children who live upon this land, pray in faith that ye shall be saved. And so what are you guys, like street performers or something? <laughs> <laughs> Seriously? Yeah, that's why I asked. Let's go <laughs> That's why I asked. Watch and learn, Gramps. Not with alchemy. So Al needs a transmutation circle. Does he have a different type of alchemy? Or is it alchemy in, in general? The full metal alchemist, Edward Elwood, hey. is that right? Wow, so you're the young prodigy to tell all the stories about? Well, we've heard so much. Oh, he loves this. <laughs> they always think it's Al. <laughs> He's in a big suit of armor and he just did alchemy. <laughs> City of Heresy, here we go. That, that's our leader, Father Cornell. We were lost until he came to town and began teaching us all the ways of the sun god Leto. He grants eternal life. Sun god Leto. So this guy's claiming he can bring the dead back to life? Now that's something I gotta see. It's just alchemy, right? That's really cool, though. That's alchemy, no doubt about it. Yeah. But somehow he's ignoring the law of equivalent exchange. He should have only been able to transmute that flower ah, I see. into equal mass. Of course, that makes sense. Yeah, there's just one way. Bingo. Something to do with that ring. Okay, he's doing something. Who is this? Rose. Please bring him back. So this is the Almighty Leto. Are you interested in Letoism? Nope, can't say I am. Not really the religious type. Then through him, all things are possible. If you believed, I'm sure Lita would bless you and make you go taller. <laughs> What's that supposed to mean? Easy, brother. She's just trying to help. Water, 35 liters. Carbon, 20 kilograms. Ammonia, 4 liters. the same liters. recipe Lime, they tried to use with their mother. Kilograms. Salt, 200 <laughs> Salt -peter. That list represents the complete chemical makeup of the human body for the average adult. It's been mm. calculated to the last microgram. You're telling me something modern science can't do, you can do with prayer? Lift thy voice to God! Did I mention all those ingredients I read off? I guess those ingredients are the exchange to make the adult, I guess, or the, the human, I guess. Turns out humans are pretty for the equal exchange. That's blasphemy. We are all children of God, created in His image. You have to understand, alchemists are scientists. It's the whole science first religion debate. Movable concepts like creators yeah. or gods. Some pretty heavy topics in this show. Physical laws that govern this world. We have, in many ways, been given the power to play gods ourselves. So you're putting yourself on the same level as God? That's just sheer arrogance. <laughs> You know, there's an old myth. He's he is he's looking at me. He is quite arrogant. He got too close. His wings melted, and he came crashing back down to earth. It's a cool shot. Well, brother. But do you think your father Cornello could even save an arrogant son ah, just like me? she's his daughter. Of course, that's wonderful. He just wants to talk to him. Visitors here, the Eldrick brothers. I can't be bothered now. Just send them away. 
<laughs> can't be bothered. That's a mood. Sure, that's what they call themselves. Emphasis no on that ring dead, there. And this is a problem. Surely they couldn't have found out about our plans. It's possible. Yeah, you're doing something shady. Too sharp for his own good. Yeah, thanks. We understand. We won't take too much of his time. Good. Then it's agreed. We'll make this quick. Yeah, bitch. Bit sus. <laughs> Rose, these heathens have come to ensnare us. Might be fortunate upon. that they think Al is the this is God's full metal alchemist here. Well, like you said, let's make this quick. <laughs> <laughs> he was not gonna shoot. Even if he shot Al, it wouldn't have done anything. Oh yeah, strike! <laughs> What's this Clean. promotion? Ah, oh, the full metal alchemist. Father Cornello! Okay, maybe yeah, she's not I'm curious about. his daughter. Like, maybe it's just father as a priest, perhaps. Deceive your followers. Look again. Could mere alchemy create something from nothing in this way? Yeah, that's well, he's not wrong. First. How can you perform transmutations that ignore the law of equivalent exchange? As I said, because it isn't alchemy. You'd somehow manage to acquire a certain object to amplify your alchemy. One that's said to make the impossible possible. Love these shots of Alan Ed together. That would explain everything. What? Talking about the yeah, he's onto you. Stone. Is that the, the ring? ring? Yeah. That's it, isn't it? Okay. So it amplifies for that. alchemy. The ring is just a ring. Or maybe that's what Al, uh, excuse me, Ed needs to perfect human transmutation, perhaps. This guy's gonna be strong though. Didn't create stuff out of nothing. That gun there beside you, pick it up. Oh dear. Okay. <laughs> now use it. No, she won't want to do that. My word is the word of Leto himself. Shoot him, Rose. It's God's will. When you straight manipulation. You that Using... accident last year. Who was oh, it damn. that saved you from the very depths of despair? It was yeah, this guy's just, just a bad guy. It was I who took your hand and led you into God's light. And you He's just using the so-called religion to manipulate people. <laughs> the animation. Shouldn't have said anything. The short one. They're always calling out his height. You know, leave us short people alone. To do this, Father Cornella will bring him back to life. I have faith. Ah, that's why she's following him. Get her fiance back. <laughs> He's fine. If she can't believe what she's done. Good. God, Lito is pleased. Now pick up the gun and shoot the other as well. Now, this guy can just die. Don't worry about it. He's pretty solid. Yeah, see? No harm done. <laughs> <laughs> An empty evil of this kind must be purged. Ooh, what do we got here? I my chimera should be up chimera. To so this is the sort of thing you do with the philosophy. Yeah, he, he's made that. Anyway, Transmutated like animals way. together. Oh, that's so cool. We're gonna get some action here. Here we go. Oh, damn. Interesting. My pants. Ooh. But I guess those claws don't do so good against steel. Yeah, against the auto mail. Once again, auto mail. Oh, yes, sir. Yeah, they can all figure it out. Woo! That's a clean shot. Why don't you come down here and try me? I'll show oh, the you real quick who the novice is. Full Metal Alchemist. This is good. Full Metal Alchemist. Full Why Metal don't you Alchemist. Come down here and try me? In their arrogance, they tried to bring someone dead back to life. Is that not what you're trying to do, though? I thought he could touch the sun, but when he got too close, his wings melted and he came crashing back down to Earth. Is he talking about himself, then? This is what happens when you try to play God. Oh, that's so interesting. Take a good look, Rose. I didn't pick up on that. Is this what you want? Because he said, isn't that right, Al? Not even half a man. Hell, not even half a boy. And oh, what enough are you? for the short jokes. You're just a phony that can't do anything without a philosopher's stone. If you fools are really so eager to play God, then perhaps I should send you to beat him instead. Ooh, oh my God. Like a Gatling gun. Me and God, we don't get along too well. Even if I went, he'd probably just send me right back here. That's so cool. Damn! This way. It's not gonna hurt, Al. I love it. 
Well, don't just stand there after them. <laughs> These heathens seek to harm the order. All they the comedic elements. Father of the church, just with a massive gun on his shoulder. <laughs> hey, yo! <laughs> you just transmutate his arm into any steel weapon. That's so cool. Oh my, look at him run. <laughs> what do you think of what he said back there is true, isn't it? All we wanted was to see our mom smile again. But our transmutation Ugh. failed. People don't come back from the dead. No dead. It's the way it should be, unfortunately. The price of even a failed human transmutation was enormous. Mm -hmm. It cost my brother his left leg, and it cost me my whole body. His leg had been taken. He was bleeding. I can't imagine the pain he was in. Yeah, it's took right. All that, he still gave up his right arm to transmute my soul. Cool. Now, I just want to help him get his body back to the way it was. But that's the path we chose. All we can do is keep moving. Keep moving forward. Look, can we just Look at this guy. Rap and talk here? So why waste all that power performing phony miracles? I got something bigger planned, it looks like. Because with each miracle, I can attract new believers to the yeah. order. In a few more years, I'll be it's ready to unimpressed. unleash this minus horde upon the world. And I'll use the Philosopher's Stone to cool tear shot. this country apart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah? Wait, what are you laughing about? <laughs> I knew it. You really are a novice, aren't you? <laughs> Got him! There were never any miracles, Rose. Oh, I thought it was a bell. It was a massive speaker. To everyone. Why you? Wow, well played. That was good. Believers heard every word. A little callback to the radio at the start of the episode too. You pay dearly for this. Damn. They're not just strong, they're really, really smart. Like, that was a good plan. It's a rebound. No, I won't be disgraced like this. Now, boy. Damn. He looks like Gluttony. I could be wrong again, it's just the same shape, but. That's crazy. My word is Damn, we're the strong, the strong. My fist is the I love that blade judgment. on his arm. Oh, yeah. The fist of God, huh? You can have it. Ooh. Oh, that's tough. It came out of the wall. That's so cool. Damn, look at him. Hey! <laughs> oh, headbutt. And there it is. Oh, it's broken though. What the hell? The stone. It's supposed to be perfect material. How does that not it? Like that? Please, I was wrong. Please, I beg you. He seems genuine here. Fake. Please yeah. don't. I'm helpless without the stone. Rest our lives for this one possible chance. And it's a fake. So, uh, but if it's fake, it doesn't explain how he can do things. I don't care what you do, just get out of here! <laughs> Interesting. I want to know more. I think this might call back to the character at the end of uh, episode one. Give me the Philosopher's Stone! Rose! Oh, Rose, come on now. So you can use it on come your on, box. Rose. That's right, and so you can try to bring Be a bit open-minded. You shut up! Ooh. People don't come back from the dead, Rose. Not ever. I think she needs to hear that, it sounds like, but... Not ever. Uh, that's painful. He said if I prayed it would happen. Oh. <sighs> and poor Rose. That hope was all I had left. Tell me what to do. Oh, come on. Help her. Please. I can't tell you that. You have to figure it out. Stand up and walk. Keep moving forward. You've got two good legs. You're strong. One leg more than he does. This is a bit, those are good words, though. Yes, all that hard work for nothing. Lust is this. Should have just inside a little rebellion. But that's gluttony. Excuse me for tunneling on that before. Not this one, gluttony. 
We don't want you getting yeah, yourself just, into Jesse. He just wants to eat him. So lust. So this was the this was the woman. I'd say this concludes our business. Snake eating its tail, sort of thing. Were to look nice, what did she transmutate? Right. Like a glove or her finger? I won't be pleased. Started thinking about our next move. Whoa. Now, yes, the same circle. Okay, good, good. Another really good episode. So, um, more questions being asked here. I, I do want to touch on while I'm thinking about it. The father was obviously using alchemy, right? without the without something to exchange without equal exchange he was just creating stuff so they explained that with the philosopher's stone but then the philosopher's stone was fake so how was he actually creating these things like was was it fake but was it still working was it something to do with lust uh, i'm really interested to get more about that in upcoming episodes it was good to get another fight sequence i love what ed can do with his metal arm he can transmutate that I'd love to see some action. If he can do the same with his leg somehow, that would be really cool. But the the alchemy and the, the transmutation seems so flexible. The amount of things they can do with it, that's really cool. I thought it was interesting they brought the whole religion versus science debate into things. Well, Rose being one of those characters who's very big on faith, and her driving force was she wanted her fiancé back, and father obviously promised her that if she prayed, she could have him back, and he backed up you know, his words with, look, I can perform miracles. I'm going to be able to bring people back from the dead. So you know, fair enough to some degree. Ed and Al coming in with the science side of things. It's just Ed's way of explaining it. It's very arrogant. Like this is absolute, this is the absolute truth. Um, but it was really cool how he was talking about, uh, some guy thought he could touch the sun. And just before he could touch his wings burned off, and he's talking about himself and his lost limbs. Um, he thought he could bring his mother back. Instead, Al lost his body and he lost two of his limbs. So that, that's a really interesting conversation i really enjoyed that so so clearly lust was using father for something uh we obviously found out father's big plan which was to have this massive mindless army which obviously is not going to come into fruition after gluttony gluttony after lust and gluttony got rid of him so they're kind of building up lust to be a significant villain uh, which i'm really excited to see she has some cool powers it seems and gluttony just seems you know like a glutton they really put that concept forward that there's no coming back from the dead so obviously rose was after her fiance and after al and ed had tried to bring their mother back and it obviously didn't work they're now saying look this isn't the natural way of why things that are dead should stay dead we'll see if they hold on to that throughout the show or if they once again try to bring their mother back that'll be really interesting but it was nice to see some development like last episode they were very centered like this is why we're learning alchemy we're going to study we're going to find all these ingredients exactly to bring mother back and now that they've gone through what they've gone through they've accepted no okay things should perhaps stay dead at least with the knowledge they had at that time so another great episode i'm really enjoying this series now that i'm a few episodes in i'm really getting invested i'm really asking questions i'm really keen to see what happens going forward